Hello everybody and welcome to Pixel Bros UK and today we've got a very special feature on the channel. Um, my mother is going to review Sonic the Hedgehog for you. So without further ado I'll, I'll pass her over. Hi everyone, Steve's mum here. I'm, as Steve said, going to be hosting a new monthly slot reviewing some of your old favourites. The first one I want to review is Sonic. First released on the Mega Drive on the 23rd of June 91 and the series sold over 80 million. It's quite a lot, isn't it? For those of you who don't know the idea of the game, Sonic collects all the gold rings he can, which gives him access to a bonus stage where he can get his emeralds, and at the end of each level, he fights the fearsome Dr. Robotnik. A bit of useless information for you um, Sonic fans. Sonic's shoes were actually designed on a pair of Michael Jackson's boots. I don't know if you know that or if you find it interesting or not, but there you go. <laughs> anyway, on with the game. So, the aim of it, as I said, is to collect the rings and also find all these hidden TVs and different hidden... Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> different hidden rings elsewhere. That's not supposed to happen. What you need to look out for is that that just got me, which was, um, what I could only describe as, sorry I got a bit of a freeze frame then I think, only describe as, um, an evil kind of wasp I suppose, anyway, um, then we've got the fishes, that we have to kill, or hit and they release the bunnies as you can see. Um, that that just went on there is like an infinity type of thing when you get all the stars around you and that stops you from being killed for a little while. These lamp posts are what you should um, <coughs> do and sorry trigger off and in turn they will take you back to that point you know what I mean. When you're hitting these, remember that they do disappear from under your feet, otherwise you'll end up in the sea with them. Um, that's not what I wanted to do, but there you go. It enables me to show you this way around, I guess. Oh! That's what I don't need to be doing. Um, we'll just see what's around here. Okay. There are little hidden tunnels everywhere and also danger levels but we've got all these rings here like one, two, three. I believe they're in tens I think so you get quite a lot. We've now got that invincibility again. Oh, I can't seem to get anywhere with it. So what you need to do is try and run up, get a bit of a spin but in my case don't bother because I can't do it. <laughs> so, oh, there we go. Right, we're over there and down the wiggly worm, as I call it, and up onto there. And that was quite good, that. That is some sort of achievement, I think, that I just hit. And was it something like a thousand? Which is quite good. Still trying to collect them because the more I collect, the um, better it's going to be for me. And I got through the ring at the end, which I like doing. I don't know if you need to do it for any particular reason, I've never looked into that. Maybe one of you can look it up and let us know on the site. Um, we're just going over oh, to my most unfavourite level. This bit is where you get the emerald and you've got to avoid falling into the goal. And then when you get to this bit, sorry, um, oh, that's what you don't need to do. If you go into that little red area, as you can see, that's it. Game over for that section, so you don't get the emerald on that point, which I failed to do. However, we've got another attempt at it now on zone 2, which I'm going to try and do. Um, we'll just see if we can bounce up there and get those rings. The other thing I suppose to remember is not to waste too much time trying to get certain rings in certain areas because sometimes you can do that and then not gain much from it because you might just walk around the corner and get killed by something or lose them all so the idea of the game is to just 
try and see what we can get. Oh, it again. I hate this bit. I'm sure there'll be some of you out there that are much better at this than me. And as you may have seen then, there was an extra life up there, which I'd like to go get, but I don't think I will. We've got a speedy foot now, so I might just ignore the extra life. Thus, when you hit one of the boats, it gives you a bit of speed and a bit of invincibility, I do believe. As I say, if I'm wrong about any of these facts, please don't hesitate to um, get on the site and let us know where I've gone wrong. I am rusty because it's like a lot of years since I've been on Sonic, so this is me just having an attempt for the first time again. I'm not doing that badly, I don't think. Oh. Um, oh! Sorry. Um, right, wiggly worms again. Then, oh, I missed the ring. Oh, no, I didn't. I can come back to it. There you go. So, past level two. Probably back onto that horrible bit where we have to try and get the gem. Let's see if we can do a bit better this time. So, like I say, the idea is to gather the rings again in here but avoid that central bit sorry not the central bit the side that's the one that you want to avoid but again it's got me mad we shall try again we're going on to the third part now green hill zone at three and this is the bit that i don't like because at the end of this we've got a robot to face but hopefully Um, hopefully we'll be able to defeat the robot and then you can just see how we get on. Um, oh! No! Where we are? Oh, I see. Wait a minute. There we are. So as you see, when you're going round this, I know they called it a track, but this um, level, you come across lots of different areas hidden gems really I suppose you like to call them but you know like hidden bonuses and things like that um, and you will get to know the layout of it so you'll know exactly where they all are and then you'll be able to crack on with it um, I'm kind of feeling my feet a bit more with it now I'll wear that oh, 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 oh. Sorry about that. Um, thought I was off the edge then. Oh! And I am now. Oh, but I'm okay. Um, um, this is probably not a very good area to be in. However. Uh, oh. Ah, yeah. So now I'm back where I was before. But maybe I can look at trying to get something else out of this now because I did everything else mm. oh shit ah well you see there's an extra life there but what was that I said earlier don't waste too much time going through on those so we won't do oh while we're going over this thing. I can get over that. Yes, yes, no! Go, 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 go! Hello, hallelujah. Um, right, here we've got some walls that are quite good to go through and then also might have some extra bonuses. Okay, so the idea is to whack him as much as you can 
ideally I could have done with a few more ring zombies because I've only got two and that's not very good because I've lost one now so I'm not gonna die. That's what happens when that happens. So, uh, as you can see this is where the bonus of the lamppost came in and um, where you start off where you triggered the last lamppost. What I am going to do is just get some rings obviously there's no point going back with nothing is there so that's what we've done we've got some there and now we'll go back and face the dreaded robot and i've got a feeling in my water we're going to do it this time well i'm going to make sure that we do oh, shit. do you know this used to be so simple after so much time no bloody hell As I said before, more rings. Like that. So we've got like 15 rings to keep us going now. Oh, God, that's a new one. Here we go. Right, this is it now. I'm in business. I can't even remember how many times we've got to fit in. But, this is it. Oh, shit! Fuck it. Um, sorry, Steve was just offering me a bit of advice in the background. Oh, I nearly went without getting the rings. Not that I don't appreciate his wisdom, but I want to try and do it anyway. Okay then, here we go. We're off now. This possibly is my last chance, and I nearly blew it then because I won't concentrate. On. Get away! Oh! God! Get me a ring. No! Oh! oh! Help! How many more times? <gasps> yes! So that's how you do it. So excited. Right then. Oh wait, let me let all the bunny rabbits out. See, I am out of practice with this because I've not been on it for quite a while. A number of years to be fair. Right, so. I think we'll leave it there so that you've just can see how it works and I hope you've enjoyed it and I'll see you on the next review. Bye.